So a while back, I bought this uh, component tester after seeing it reviewed in a few different videos online as a tool that would make it a little bit easier to identify parts just out of your junk bin, right? And um, it was cheap enough, so I went for it, and it works pretty well. Um, I won't go into depth in explaining how it works, but it's fairly simple. Put in a part, turn it on, and you can get the results. But the first thing I noticed that the screen was extremely bright, and I thought that that may be wasting a little bit of battery. So today I wanted to just look into reducing the brightness of the screen and seeing if that has any impact on battery life. All right, first off, let's start by measuring the current this um, uses just in a normal operation. So we can see that it's off. It's using zero milliamps right now. Let's turn it on and shoots up to around, I don't know, 14 milliamps, something like that. Which uh, I guess isn't too bad. Um, so on the back of the board, we can see the power comes in here and then it goes over to this transistor and it goes through this 33K um, resistor into the base um, and then here let me turn on oops there we go okay so if we trace it we can see that this positive goes here to this button so it pulls up this button and also to the positive on the LCD. So it does go through this 1K, marked 1K resistor. So what I'd like to do is replace this 1K resistor with something not too much more, maybe a 2.2 or maybe a 4.7 would be too high um, to reduce the brightness of the screen but at the same time we have to note that this button is pulled up by this same resistor so we don't want to go too high where we disable the functionality of the button so let's go find a suitable resistor put it on see if it still works and measure the current again All right, so I figure I'll just try a small boot pump in the resistance. Here's a 2.2K resistor out of my book here, my nice sample book. Um, so let's remove this one and put that one in place. All right, now the iron seems like it's hot. Let's try to remove this resistor. This won't be too fun behind the camera, but um, these appear to be 0805 resistors. Let's heat this up. that. Let's clean this up a little bit. Put a little solder on one of the pads. Clean enough. Right, let's find 
find our new resistor. Okay, and let's see if it still works and see how much current this thing draws now. See if it's any dimmer as well. Okay. Everything in view here. All right. Okay, so might as well actually test it out with a component also. Okay, so I hooked it up wrong. It's already drawing current. Okay, that's better. Okay, I'm not sure if you can see this here, but zero. Okay, it's on. Trying about 15 milliamps, 10 milliamps. So it looks like it may have reduced its just standby current from about 14, 15 to uh, 10. And it still appears to work. Let's power it back off. Power it on, see if it... Uh, so if I recall correctly, it was about 15 milliamps before. Now it's about 10. So it seems as though it's still functional and we reduce the current and the brightness just a little bit with the 2.2 k ohm resistor in place of the 1 k ohm resistor that was there. So I hope you enjoyed this video and find it useful.